Now moving on to part C, we got x squared plus y squared is equal to 36. And as you can tell, this is a standard circle that's gonna be centered at zero and zero. Remember a standard circle, the equation of it is x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared. And so we could find the radius of this by taking the r squared, making it equal to 36, square root both sides, radius ends up being six. And so when we draw a circle with a radius of six that's centered at zero and zero, we end up with a diagram like that. And so from here, what's the domain gonna be? Well, basically X can be the element of any real numbers, it could be any number as long as it's gonna be between negative six and positive six, those two X intercepts. Same thing for the range, Y is an element of real numbers such that y is greater than or equal to negative six, but less than or equal to positive six. Now, is this gonna be a function or not? Well, if we run the vertical line test through it, notice it's gonna fail at a bunch of points. There's going to be multiple y values for single x values, hence the relation is not going to be a function.